As we've been reading through the book of Job, it's clear that this is a very profound book that's immersed in the themes of suffering, faith, and ultimately, God being completely in control even when things seem, and they are, out of our control. In chapter 6, Job begins to respond to his friend's attempts to bring comfort. And throughout this chapter, he shares the heartbreak he's going through. And honestly, just the need he has for some real comfort. You know, Job compares his suffering to the weight of the sands of the sea in verses 2 and 3. And he seems to just genuinely long for his friends to show true compassion and understanding. And he says to do so, it would be like receiving refreshing water for a thirsty traveler in the desert. Job, he's pouring out his heart in this chapter. And I think Job's response brings to focus the need, the importance of genuine, compassionate, even empathetic communication in our own relationships. You see, Job's response, it also encourages us to bring our pain and our heartache directly to God, honestly and openly. And as you read through this chapter, maybe take it as an opportunity to do a little personal inventory. What I mean is, ask yourself, am I compassionate to the needs of those who are around me, to, to the suffering that they're going through? Do I, do I really show care and concern? And when I'm going through something, do I approach God with honesty and vulnerability, seeking His comfort and His guidance? Remember, Job's story, it, it ultimately points us to the faithfulness of God, even in the midst of suffering and heartache. And today, let's be reminded from this chapter that our ultimate hope, our ultimate comfort, is found in God, who truly is our staying source of strength and comfort.